Hi guys, just wanted to make a short video for you guys. I like cigars. I'm an avid cigar smoker. Um, and I just tried the Denobly uh, Italian cigars. And um, tell you the truth, really, they're not bad. You know, sweet, uh, a little um, strong on the tobacco, but really, really good. Now, I don't know if any of you guys have these in your area, uh, any of my cigar lovers. Um, I've been smoking cigars for several years now. I'd say since high school, I'm 41. So I've been smoking cigars for off and on for about 20 years, I'd say. And this is my first time actually trying this cigar. And it's really, really good. And here's the package. I'm going to flip my phone around and show you the package that they're in in my cigar box. I keep them in my cigar box, cigar box just to keep everything together and, you know, keep it going. But, and there's the packaging. And I tell you, they're really good. There's five cigars, too. And like I said, they're, they're, these are it. And I never was... I heard my mom always telling me my great-grandfather loved these. So I wanted to try one. And I found them at my local cigar shop. And... Let me tell you something. They're not really that bad. I know a few years ago my friend tried one and they they really stunk. I don't know what they did to these cigars now, but I tell you something, they're really different now and they are they have a mellow taste to them. So if you guys get ever get a chance to try to try one of these, I suggest it. See what you think of it. It might be they they're like on a medium scale, I'd say, in my book. But, I mean, they're not a bad cigar, not at bad at all. And I tell you what, uh, the tobacco, they're tight. They're really tight. I don't know if you guys can see that in the light. Um, but they're, I've been maybe chewing on this end for a little bit. And so far, it's not unraveled. You know, sometimes you chew on them, they unravel a little bit. And I tell you what, they're really packed tight. They're machine, I think, machine wrapped. And I tell you what, I never thought I would like a cigar this much. Because I have different, you know, some more groovy blues, uh, different ones. And I really like it. I tell you, not bad. Very nice taste to them. And I'm surprised that these are actually, they're de Nobles. They're supposedly Italian cigars, but they're made somewhere, I don't know exactly where. They used to be made in Scranton, PA. And I tell you, um, they're very nice tasting. So, you know what? If you guys get a chance to try one of these, give it a try. You know, any of my cigar smokers out there? Um, I suggest it. You know, I liked it. Now, the one guy I saw the other day was actually videotaping. He actually had one that was like... Oh my god, six, seven inches. I never had those. I can't find those. But these ones are probably around four inches. Four, three, four inches. A little bit, maybe a little bit longer. And they come in a pack of five, like I showed you right there. And um, not bad a cigar. Uh, like I said, I... I like them. They're a very mellow cigar. And they're very, very tightly packed. So if you ever guys ever get a chance to try one. Or let me know if you have had these. Let me know. Leave your comments in the comment area. And see what you guys think. Me, I like them. So, you know, each to their own. But, I mean, you know, you smoke what you want. I smoke different varieties. As you can see in my box. And I tell you, they're not too bad. I mean, I never thought they would be this good. Seriously. And they were cheap. They were only less than five bucks for five of them. That ain't bad. So, but let me know what you guys think. And if you guys have had these, leave a comment down below. And 
holler at me if you have had these and let me know what you think and to my cigar smokers out there this like puffs for you bros guys and girls I've, I've known women to smoke cigars too so but this one's for you guys so keep on puffing later guys